Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Priscilla. So today we'll be doing a uh, purple smoky eye. If you like what you've seen so far, make sure to stay tuned. So obviously, I'm starting off with her brows first, just using a brown pencil right there to fill in her brows. We're just really laughing because my mom was in the room while I was filming, but that's that. But I just went ahead and filled in her brows, and I'm using my Ellie Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Fun to um, clean out the brows. Now dipping into my Juvie's Place palette for the eyes. I love my Juvie's Place palette. It's like they're one of the best palettes that I have. And this one is just so natural and I really just love it. Like the neutral colors and all that, you know. Something light. But yeah, I'm just going ahead and just applying those shadows right there. So to achieve that smoky purple eye look, I went into my subculture from Anastasia. I'm not really a big fan of this palette to be quite honest. But you know, you gotta make it work. Now I went ahead and applied my pigment. I think it's in shade Violet from MAC Cosmetics. And just do my thing, <laughs> basically. So the same thing goes for the other eye as well. This is like super, super therapeutic, I feel. I always spend like so much time on uh, on the eyes whenever I really want to do it. Does that even make sense whenever I really want to do it? <laughs> but guys, I think you kind of get the gist. So it was kind of too dark for me, so I took my Jackie Aina collab with Anastasia and I just dabbed on the lightest pink shade, a uh, purple shade, sorry, purple shade that was under. Oh my god, what is she doing? Like, wow, sis, close your mouth. But yeah, I'm now going in with the foundation. I have a whole tutorial on like how I apply foundation and all that, so I'm not really gonna dwell on this too much but we're just blending 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 and um you guys know how much i really i don't like talk truths because like i really am bad at it but right now i'm applying my concealer from too faced too faced too faced and uh yeah that's about it you know Highlights in the forehead, the nose, the bridge of the nose, and contouring that nose to get that snatched look. I'm using my NYX contour kit. I don't know why I call this a kit, but <laughs> yeah. So that's about it. You know, just place uh, product placements right now. Um, this is probably like. One of my favorite aspects of makeup too. You know, just snatching that face, you know, giving that face a whole new concept to it, if that makes sense. <laughs> but that's basically it guys, like it is so therapeutic. Is it just me? literally all you gotta do is blend blend baby blend baby you don't want no harsh lines anywhere anywhere so i went ahead and i uh set the face with my la merci translucent powder loose powder a c2 c2 oh yeah i really like this process too so i've not been setting like i'm um, baking um not really as of recent but I've, i really don't enjoy baking that much these days but that's just a side note so i'm using this dark deep um powder from laura mercier also here contouring her face with the morphe palette they actually discontinued this palette i just checked um 
recently to see if you still had it but they discontinued it so whoops um just adding a bit of you know what's it called again oh my gosh guys i have a <laughs> just adding a bit of you know color to the skin i don't know what this is called i can't remember what this is called there's contour, there's highlight, and there's... Y'all are literally seeing the true me. I have a fish brain, but that's that. So I didn't want to put on uh, falses, so I just wanted to then use individual lashes. This was probably like one of the longest process of the makeup application. It was actually my first time using uh, individual lashes, but they came out really super natural and all that, which was what I was going for. I didn't want it to look like uh, she had lashes on. So, yes, mission, 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 what do you call it? Mission accomplished. Wow, <laughs> mission accomplished, y'all. So I went ahead and um, got rid of the excess powder with my MAC Mineralized Finishing Powder. And she looks really good, y'all, like really good. I wish this was my face, to be quite honest, sometimes. I wish someone was just doing makeup on my face, but she's very lucky to have a sister like me. Okay. <laughs> and obviously, she can't keep her mouth closed for too long, so here she is eating. When I had it, added a bit of more glow with my MAC uh, highlighter. This girl stays complaining. Like every single second she cannot keep her mouth closed <laughs> for one second y'all i literally got tired of her so here she's eating again lord jesus have mercy drinking what would she do i don't know but I just, um using my nrx uh, lip liner i'm giving her lips because this girl doesn't have any any whatsoever like her lips are not defined, so we should get the ink off her pencils. Gotta give her some definition. Using my MAC lipstick to just give her that ombre effect. Kinda went overboard with it. So here I'm trying to fix my mess. Yes, yes, I do make mistakes. Nobody is perfect. But yeah, you know, just do my thing. I really can't wait for quarantine to be over, quarantine to be over, so I could beat more faces. I'm actually gonna take, like, take my, take my work seriously, like seriously, seriously. <laughs> I'm being serious. <laughs> but yeah, I'm finishing up my face with some spray, complaining as usual. So that's about it guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to stay tuned for other videos and stay blessed, stay safe. God bless you all. Peace out.